Yeah, welcome our dear viewers who are following us on this platform. I'm teacher Joshua Wester by the names, teacher of social studies. Tonight, I'm going to take you through primary five social studies. And our topic of discussion today, we are going to discuss about natural resources in Uganda. Natural resources in Uganda. That is the topic of discussion tonight, primary five. As you are very eager there following me, let's start. In our topic as we, we are discussing, we are going to define the following terms. We are going to see what is a resource. We are going to define what is natural resource. And we shall see the types of resources. And the types of resources, we shall see that we have two types of natural resources. And we have the renewable resources and the non-renewable resources. Let's start. We are going to start with the by the definition as what is a, a resource. A resource is anything used of anything that satisfy my needs. Needs. We can define as a resource. A resource is anything that satisfies money's needs. You can pick up to be a resource is anything that satisfies money's needs. Anything that can satisfy your need is what we call a resource. Then a natural resource. One, two, natural How do we define a natural resource? We borrow this definition as a natural resource is anything is anything that satisfy man's needs and exist on its own. For this, the natural resource is anything that satisfies man's needs and exists on its own. Man means a human being, no matter it doesn't segregate the female or male, it's both. Man represents a human being. So anything that satisfies man's needs and existed on its own. Or another one can say is anything of nature people use to satisfy their to, to satisfy their needs can be also the definition of a resource. Examples of natural resources. Examples of natural resources. One of the examples of these natural resources that satisfy man's needs. One, we have land. Two, minerals. Three, we have vegetation. Vegetation. Four, we have people. They are also resources. Five, 
water bodies six air and others these are all of the examples that exist naturally and man uses them to satisfy his or her needs where we are going we are going to see how does land as a resource we shall look at minerals as resources we shall look at vegetation as a resource we shall look at also people as a resource stroke of man of course man acts as a human labor how is it important how is man important towards the risk how is man important as a resource we shall look at the water bodies in water bodies we have very many in the lakes these drainage areas water bodies and we shall look at also air as a resource let's go further and look at the types of natural resources types of natural resources mind you mind you learners we have Major two types of natural resources. Types of natural resources. And to begin with, we have renewable resources. And number two, we have the Nani. Renewable, many renewable resources. These are the two types of natural resources. Two types of the natural resources we have. One, I say we have the renewable, the renewable resources, and two, the many renewable resources. Let's begin. Let's see the definition of the renewable resources. You are there. What are renewable resources as a type of a natural resource? What are renewable resources? What are renewable resources? What are renewable natural resources? Renewable natural resources, these are resources that satisfy man's needs and they can be replaced naturally after use. Once they get existing, they can be replaced naturally. These are resources which we they get used up can be replaced naturally these are resources these are resources which when they get used up can be replaced naturally or these are resources which satisfy man's needs and they can be replaced naturally after use 
of these are resources that satisfy money's need and can be replaced naturally once they get used up or we always use that word once they get exhausted once they get used up or once they get when once they get exhausted exhausted to get used up these are natural resources then the nanny renewable nanny renewable resources the nanny renewable resources what are the nanny renewable resources for the nanny renewable resources these are resources that once they get used up they cannot be replaced naturally or they can't when once they get exhausted they cannot be replaced these are resources nanny renewable resources these are resources when these are sources that satisfy satisfy money's needs and they cannot cannot be replaced once they are used up. These are sources that satisfy man's need and they cannot be replaced once they are used up or rather once they are exhausted. These resources for them, they cannot be replaced back. Let's see the examples of the renewable resources. Examples of the renewable resources, we have water. Water can be replaced back. We have soil. Soil, once it is used up, it can be replaced back. And lastly, another one, in an in example of natural resources, we have vegetation. This one you can plant there. Then the examples of non renewable. Examples of the non renewable resources we have now. Clay. Salt. Gold. Sand. We can categorize this as all minerals. And any renewable. All minerals are non renewable resources. As I conclude my lesson, this has been our topic of discussion, and we shall go through the work. We shall, when we the time, we shall continue where we have stopped. However, they can ask some of the questions.
For example, question one, what is a resource? You define a resource very well. Then number two, not what is a natural resource? Examples of natural resources, types of natural resources, or rather, the renewable resources define what the difference between a renewable resource and a non-renewable resource. My dear viewers, thank you for listening. God bless you. Bye-bye.